crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The first sorrowful mystery this the agony in the garden jesus agonized in the garden of gethsemane he knew he was starting down the road that would lead to his torture and death the next day in his anguish he turned to his father in prayer let us who desperately desire an end to this pandemic imitate his example and turn to god in prayer let us have true sorrow for our sins, and cry to God for His mercy. And then let us submit to the Father's will, as Jesus did, saying, Not my will, but thy be done. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O my, o my Jesus, Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins, sins. save us from, from the fires of hell, hell and lead all souls, souls into heaven. heaven especially those in need most of your divine mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, grant peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. The Scourging at the Pillar 700 years before Christ, Isaiah wrote about the Messiah, but he was pierced for our sins, crushed for our iniquity. He bore and the punishment that makes us whole, and by his wounds we were healed. Let us remember how much the innocent and pure Son of God suffered for us as we cry out to Him for the healing of our world during this pandemic. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O oh my, oh my Jesus, Jesus, forgive, forgive us, us our sins. sins. Save, Save us, us from, from the, the fires, fires of, of hell, hell, and lead all souls into heaven especially those in need most of your divine mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, grant peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. The crowning with thorns. The Roman soldiers mocked and spat on Jesus, 
the pure and innocent Savior of the world, and crowned the King of kings with praising thorns, yet he opened not his mouth. May those who suffer during this pandemic be given the courage to unite their suffering to Christ for the conversion and salvation of all. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O my Which... Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven, especially those in need most of your divine mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, grant peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. The carrying of the cross. Jesus carried the instrument of his torture, this tool of his executioners, upon the thorn and bloody flesh of his back. Yet he knows his suffering isn't over. The worst is yet to come. Lord, help each of us have the patience to suffer the isolation that we must practice in order to mitigate this pandemic and eventually bring it to an end. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. 
Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven especially those in need most of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, grant peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. The crucifixion and death of our Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus was stripped of his garments and nailed to the cross, where he hung in excruciating pain, each breath a monumental effort. He willingly surrendered his life for the eternal souls of all, including his killers, loving them until his final breath. Let us pray for the medical personnel who risk their lives to care for those who could pass a potentially deadly disease onto them, and help us all to preserve in prayer, persevere in prayer to bring this pandemic to an end. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven, especially those in need most of your mercy. Mother Mary, we beg you, grant peace to our families, to our country, and to the whole world. Hail, Holy Queen. Mother of mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, O most gracious Advocate, your eyes of mercy towards us, and after these our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, this only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant, we beseech you, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary, of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Good afternoon, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Good afternoon, Father. So in this Mass, let us thank the Lord for gracing St. Paul University, Dubaguete, with ample blessings. And let us also ask God to continue to protect us, to continue to guide us, to continue to sustain us in our ministry as we continue in our mission. And so to prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries, let us now acknowledge our sins. Ikaw na nag-aalis ng mga kasalanan ng mundo, Panginoon, mawa ka sa amin. Almighty God, have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty, ever-living God, increase our faith, hope, and charity, and make us love what you command, 
so that we may merit what you promise. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. A reading from Letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians. Brothers and sisters, be subordinate to one another out of reverence for Christ. Wives should be subordinate to their husbands as to the Lord. For the husband is head of his wife, just as Christ is head of the church. He himself, the Savior of the body, as the church is subordinate to Christ, so wives should be subordinate to their husbands in everything. Husbands, love your wives, even as Christ loved the church, and handed himself over for her to sanctify her, cleansing her by the bath of water with the word, that he might present to himself the church in splendor without spot or wrinkle or any such thing, that she might be holy and without blemish. So also husbands should love their wives as to their own bodies. He who loves his wife loves himself. For no one hates his own flesh, but rather nourishes and cherishes it, even as Christ does the church because we are members of his body. For this reason, a man shall leave his father and his mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Blessed are those who fear the Lord. Blessed are those who fear the Lord. Blessed are you who fear the Lord, who walk in his way. For you shall eat the fruit of your handiwork. Blessed shall you be and favored. Blessed are those who fear the Lord. Your wife shall be like a fruitful vine in the recesses of your home. Your children, like olive plants, around your table. Blessed are those who fear the Lord. Behold, thus is the man blessed who fears the Lord. The Lord bless you from Zion. May you see the prosperity of Jerusalem all the days of your life. Blessed are those who fear the Lord. Please stand. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said, What is the kingdom of God like? To what can I compare it? It is like a mustard seed that a man took and planted in the garden. When it was fully grown, it, become, it became a large bush, and the birds of the sky dwelt in its branches. Again he said, To what shall I compare the kingdom of God? 
It is like yeast that a woman took and mixed in with the three measures of wheat flour until the whole batch of dough was leavened. Sisters and brothers, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Sister Jocelyn Lasala, SPC, our beloved president, and our dear sisters here in Dumaguete, faculty and staff, alumni, students, and my dear Polinian friends in the Lord, good afternoon. Let me share to you a story written by Willie of Summer, entitled, being a light. In one corner of the world is squatted a bad-tempered, grumbling, friendless darkness. Suddenly there ap appeared in forsaken corner a tiny light. It was small, but it was a light. Someone had put it there. It just stood there and radiated. A passerby remark, Don't you think you would be more useful somewhere else and not in this God-forsaken corner? Why? Ask the little light. I shine because I am a light. And because I shine, I am a light. I don't shine in order to be seen. No. I shine because it gives me joy to shine and to be a light. But when the gloomy darkness heard this, it gritted its teeth and full of fury tried to put the light out. But the gigantic darkness was powerless against this tiny light. Today's gospel speaks about two parables, the mustard seed and the yeast. What is common between the two? Both are small. Both are insignificant. But in the end, the smallest seed turned out to be the largest bush. The yeast mixed with the three measures of wheat flour became a whole batch of living bread. What can we learn from these two parables? First, good things come from small beginnings. Insignificant things could turn out to be important. The ordinary could become special. Thus, whoever we are, small or insignificant, we are still valuable in the eyes of God. Whoever we are, simple or ordinary, we are still important for God. Whatever we have, little or less, we can still contribute a lot. Whatever we are, and skilled or average, we can still make a difference. You may not be the best in your class, the most talented musician, or even the best athlete, or the best teacher. But you can still be the best version of yourself that you or anyone have ever seen. In the eyes of God, no one is left behind. No one goes unnoticed. No one is forgotten. Everyone in sight of God is special. Second, there is always the idea of growth. There is always change. There will be improvement. No one should remain as he or she is. Here at St. Paul University, students are helped to understand your, their abilities and become better human beings. No one should remain passive or stagnant. No one should regress or go backward. We can grow we can overachieve, we can improve, we can progress. 
we should not resign to our situation, to ourselves and reason out, ganito lang ako. It is useless. That's the only thing I can do. Sisters and brothers, for us to grow, we need to be always grateful. A grateful person appreciates the little things and the people in his or her life. So with an open mind and grateful heart, he or she knows that he or she can succeed much more. Small steps lead to milestones. My dear friends, remember this. God will not walk away from us again. God will not walk away from us. God will not give up on us. He will do and give everything to us so that we can move forward in life and we can grow in His grace. God will always move people to help and assist us. God will always give fresh hope, another chance, new opportunities so that we can improve and renew our lives. God will always do something good, something beneficial for us even in this time of pandemic, so that we can advance in grace, overcome temptations, and merit eternal life. God goes out for us, does everything in our favor, so that as the gospel says, then the righteous will shine like the sun in the kingdom of their Father. Fellow Polinians, to be the light means in times of darkness, in times of pandemic, in times of catastrophes, you offer hope, encouragement, kindness, and compassion. You shine because you are light. You don't shine in order to be seen. No, you shine because it gives you joy to shine and to be a light. Dear Polinians, ignite the world with the Polinian spirit wherever you are. And so let us pray. Almighty God and merciful Father, right now with your grace and guidance, I will go on. I will strive and persevere in being a light. I will act to the utmost of my ability. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Please stand. Like a great tree with flourishing branches, or like a seed quietly growing, so the kingdom of God spreads. We make our prayers together as our share in that loving plan of divine providence. In every intention, let our response be, God of life, Make our lives life-giving. God of life, make our lives life-giving. That the church may continue to grow by welcoming and redeeming human cultures and values. Let us pray to the Lord. God of life, make our lives life-giving. That those involved in economic development programs may support farmers and may those who develop land protect and respect the natural environment. Let us pray to the Lord. God of life, make our lives life-giving. That our families, especially of grace, and mature in Christ-like people. Let us pray to the Lord. God of life, make our lives life-giving. That the sick may be steadfast in their faith and may be strengthened through our care and concern. Let us pray to the Lord. 
God of life, make our lives life-giving. That our, lo- that our beloved dead may enjoy the peace of God's kingdom, let us pray to the Lord. God of life, make our lives life-giving. That each Polinian, inspired by loving service, manifested by our founder and first SPC sisters, may continue to be instruments of God's unceasing love, especially to those who need to be con- consoled and comforted due to their conditions in life. Let us pray to the Lord. God of, God of life, life, make, make our, our lives life giving. That those who suffer in any way at this time, the poor, the hungry, the homeless, persecuted, those who are depressed or lonely may be comforted by the risen Lord. Let us pray to the Lord. God of life, make our lives life-giving. Heavenly Father, help us to grasp the importance of the time in which we are living. Open our hearts to your word so that we may always bear fruit. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good in the good of all His holy church. Look, we pray, O Lord, on the offerings we make to your majesty, that whatever is done by us in your service may be directed above all to your glory. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For although you have no need of our praise, yet our thanksgiving is itself your gift. Since our praises add nothing to your greatness, but profit us for salvation through Christ our Lord. And so, in company with the choirs of angels, we praise you, and with joy we proclaim.
You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, giving thanks, broke it, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again, until you come again, we proclaim. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, and Holito, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of their resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life. And may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through Him, with Him, and in Him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, Almighty Father, forever and ever. Amen, 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 amen. At the Savior's command and formed by His divine teaching, we dare to say, Thank you. 
Deliver us, Lord, we pray from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I live you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. As one community, let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the banquet of the Lamb. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in our most holy sacrament. 
I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to, to be separated from you. Amen.
let us pray. May your sacraments, O Lord, we pray, perfect in us what lies within them, that what we now celebrate in signs we may one day possess in truth, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Horatio Imperata on COVID-19. God, our Father, we come to you in our need. Your protection against the COVID-19 that has disturbed and even claimed lives. We pray that you guide the people thus to find cures for this disease and to stem its transmission. Protect, Protect the, the medical, medical experts that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health soon. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in this trying time to work for the good of all and to help those in need. We implore you to stop the spread of the virus and to, and to save, save us from, from our fears. Grant, Grant all this through our Lord Jesus Christ, Christ your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin. Amen. Our Lady, health of the sick. Pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel. Pray for us. Saint Rock. Pray for us. Saint Lorenzo Ruiz. Pray for us. Saint Pedro Calungsod. Pray for us. Saint Catherine of Alexandria. Pray for us. Saint Paul. Pray for us. We would like to thank Reverend Father John Rinel Kiliope for celebrating the Holy Mass with us. <laughs> to Dr. Redor Carale and the choir from the college faculty, and to our sponsors from the College of Arts, Sciences, and Education, College of Business and Information Technology, and College of Nursing, thank you very much. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Please bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May Almighty God bless you in His kindness and pour out saving wisdom upon you. Amen. May He nourish you always with the teachings of the faith and make you persevere in holy deeds. Amen. May He turn your steps towards Himself and show you the path of charity and peace. Amen. And may the Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass has been offered. Let us go to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.
that speaks your word, your word of mercy and of peace. And I will sing forever. I will sing forever.